What's up, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Shidukin and welcome to another full game commentary. And today we are going to be playing as Blood Moon Cannon in the top lane, as requested by Dark Devil 19 thank you for that request. If you guys have any requests for champions for me to do in the future, just throw it down in the comments, don't mind playing anything off meta or anything, I just like playing fun things. We're just going to go ahead and start with the uh, Doran's Blade in the health potion actually, because Cannon does have quite a bit of damage from his auto attacks, because he also has what, his uh... Q passive, E passive, something like that. Uh, is a W passive, every 5 attacks, Kennen deals bonus magic damage equal to 40% of his attack damage, and adds a mark of the storm to his target. Okay. So let's uh, go over Kennen's abilities. Passive is mark of the storm. My ability, my abilities add 1 stack of mark of the storm to a target for 6 seconds. If the target reaches 3 stacks, it's stunned for 1.25 seconds, and I gain 25 energy. That is one of the things about Kennen, is I don't use mana, and I don't have really any resource, but I do have energy, so I am in that lovely ninja class, which I like to play so much. W is Electrical Surge, the passive I already talked about is the uh, power to auto every 5 attacks. Active is I ascend a surge of electrical energy through all nearby units affected by Mark of the Storm, or slicing mails from my ult, and uh, deals damage. E is Lightning Rush, basically I turn into a little ball of lightning, also known as Pikachu, and run around really fast, I gain 10 armor and MR for 4 seconds, and I deal damage. Uh, when I go through every enemy. Also gain enemy the first time I pass through... I gain energy the first time I pass through an enemy. Lightning Lash deals half damage to champions. Okay. Uh, I think we're just going to start out with our Q, because Poppy is most likely... Or our W. Just to uh, help us CS. I don't really know if this is right. I, I've played Kennen like twice. The only reason I have a skin for him is because uh, Ken is the... Kennen's the... Well, this skin, actually, is what Riot decided to give me once Hextech Crafting came out. Okay, so that's my little empowered auto. She just cancelled her auto. She doesn't have a uh, grass proc, which is good for me. Just get that auto off. Oh, okay. We're at 5 CS right now. Just gonna keep farming, keep farming. I forgot to rearrange my scoreboard, so we'll try to do that whilst CSing. Shouldn't be too hard, because Poppy, uh, doesn't really put much pressure on us. We're just going to take our d Q as second, because it is our second damage ability. Switch that. So I'm with Grasp. Okay. Make sure to Q to get that. And auto. And bam. Cool. In the top lane is me, Cannon, versus a Poppy. In the jungle is a Lee Sin versus Graves. In the mid is a R Malzahar versus an Ari. And in the bot lane, we have a Lucian Janna versus a Jin Sona. With the Sona running Grasp with the Undying, which is kind of weird. Usually she runs Thunderlords or Windspeakers. Depending on, uh, yeah, that's just kind of weird. So the basic uh, combo with Cannon is basically just you want to get your uh, passive off as much as possible. So you want to stun him up. Uh, easiest way to do that is wait till you have a fifth empowered auto, and then Q W, or you can run through him and then press W. Basically, you just want to proc him up, stun him, make him a mobile, and then you just ult, and your ult does ridiculous damage. And we missed that CS. How are we doing CS-wise? We actually uh, double her CS. That's good. I'm gonna t max my Q first, because it's the most, what, most spammable ability we have, and also it's range harass. Of course, we're just going to CS for the time being. We're not going to go AD or anything. We're actually going to build Proto Belt first, because that was the uh, request for this video. Which sounds kind of fun to me. Missed that one. Um, yeah, so... We'll see how this goes. Protobot will give me a little bit more ability, mobility, so I don't have to just flash in all the time. Oh my god. Oh my god, Poppy, come on. I'm just gonna uh, pop a health potion. The one we have. And uh, I guess we won that trade. She's running Corrupting Potion, so she actually will be able to heal up more than we are. But we do have the lifesteal from our Doran's Blade. So, she will heal up off of that. Go ahead and pick up First Blood and flash away. I don't think I'm going to be able to get out of this. Okay. We got two flashes for that, so that's not pretty... It's actually pretty good for me. Uh, we're going to go ahead and... Uh, Go for the Hextech Revolver first, pick up a couple of health potions, and a pink ward, and we're going to just teleport back to lane, because I don't want to miss out on that fat wave of experience. 
Picked up first blood, good for me. Poppy get, did get an assist, but we're still way ahead of her in CS. Looks like bot lane picking up a double kill, so that's good. Come on. Oh my god! I'm awful. I'm I'm truly awful. Okay. We're just gonna farm. We actually might try to freeze this, because if Poppy keeps trying to go aggro on us, we can... I think we can just keep killing her, because we don't have any dashes, so her W doesn't stop anything. It'll stop Proto Belt, but that's one dash every, what, 45 seconds? So... I am the wind. Uh, we're going to get our ult here, so that's good. Once Poppy gets her ult, I actually don't think it'll do that much for her. Get no, we missed the siege minion. Sad life. We're just going to ult and then kill her. Okay. That was, um, that was really easy. What the hell? Holy shit. This can this champion is strong. I thought, huh. Why don't I play him very much? I think I don't play him that much because he uh, doesn't have any dashes or mobility. I mean, he has his E. His little lightning rush is pretty good. We're going to pop a health potion and then uh, try and roam bot. Poppy has no teleport. We're actually going to drop a pink ward deep in their jungle near his uh, the Graves' red buff. Because that should be up in about a minute 30. And by that time, my ultimate should be up. And we can maybe pick up a kill on him. Why are you coming to me? I'm just I'm warding. No one's here. Poppy teleported back to lane, so I'm just going to run up there. She's... Matt, she's rushing armor. She's rushing an ice wearing gauntlet, but um, that's not going to be very useful against me, because I'm magic damage. Besides my auto attacks. And look, there's half of her health. Just from an empowered auto, and a Q, and a W. My ult up in 50 seconds. Come on. Ah. Dun dun dun. Let's get that proc off with the fifth auto. And looks like Graves is bought, so we're pretty safe right now. Um, when is his red up? His red's up not within the next 40 seconds. So my ult will definitely be up by the time his red is up. Missed the Q, that's okay. Because we just farming. We don't have our teleport up for another two minutes. So, uh... Oh my god, how do I keep missing these point blank Qs? I know how. It's because I'm bad. And no, not bad to the bone. Bad to the soul, to the core. Just, just overall bad. Um, shit. I believe I maxed my W second. It's just for the damage. I'm just gonna go walk up. Get the W proc off, and yeah, good stuff. Dun, dun, dun. Poppy's just chilling in the back. I can zone her off this experience, actually. So, uh, she won't be able to level very well. Because I have my ult up, and I miss the CS. Because I'm bad. Missed that by hitting a minion, cause we're bad. Get that, get that, and get the, not get that, cause we bad, we bad. Oh my god, this key actually flies out faster than I thought it thought it did. It's a uh... oh. No, I'm gonna die! No! Shit, I misplayed that so hard. Did she ult me? I am ambassador, her, her Michelle, correct charge. I took so much damage from her Q, holy shit. We can pick up our proto belt. Slap that on the 4 key, actually. Because it's pretty offensive. Or at least we're gonna use it offensively. God damn, that sucked. She was just out of my range, but she has no flash. I didn't account for that. Uh, that was my bad. I completely miscalculated that. Ooh. He's level 7. 
his warrior. Uh, if I had uh, teleported up when he had gotten there, I would have done. I would have uh, gone in, but unfortunately, I did not. We're also doing much better than Poppy. Uh, we have a kill up on her. She has an assist, so basically like half kill up. And then uh, we're up 23 CS. We can get a lot of this though. Hopefully, what's the range of my Q? We're just gonna electrical surge through all of it, and then proc the W. I know Graves is topside, so I'm gonna. Yeah, just gonna flash proto belt away. Ooh, oh, I thought it would hit Poppy with that. We're gonna pop the health potion we have. One, two, auto. One, two, auto. If you guys don't know, oh shit. Uh, if you're AD, it's a lot easier to do, but um, if you're AP, it's harder. Uh, with when you're trying to CS under tower, the melee creeps. That's a dead Ari. Melee creeps. If they take two shower shots, you can just auto them once to get the uh, finishing blow on the minion. If you for range creeps, it's a little different. You have to auto it once, and then th take one tower shot, and then auto it again. So you gotta auto it before the tower hits it. Otherwise, uh, oh damn that damage. You'll uh, you'll miss the minions. CSing was probably the hardest thing that uh, I needed had to get used to because I I came from Minecraft to play this game. Like I didn't play Minecraft that much. I didn't play like PvP. I just like to build a bunch of cool stuff like elevators and redstone traps and stuff like that. But uh, so I came over from Minecraft from moving around with like WASD. And then getting used to like MOBA style QWER was the hardest thing for me to ever do. It took me so long to play. And back when I was like level, like up to level 10, I used to play Warwick bot all the time. Ooh, half your health and got the stun off. Cool. We have Proto Belt. So we have Proto Belt into ult. Missed the Q. Keep taking tower shots, but that's okay. Poppy has no bonus health right now, so and she has armor, no MR. So her auto, my auto take a little less damage from her, but other than that, all my abilities should go through her pretty well. I don't think she, uh, I don't think she has much MR in her runes. If so, it's probably like, yeah, pretty standard. She does get stats from her, her, what was it W? I, I don't know what the hell she just did. She charged at me, didn't tackle me, didn't try to cue me, she just ran up and died. Consider me absolutely, absolutely confused. What I'm guessing what happened is that she uh, was watching somewhere else, and then she thought she was playing them, and just totally fucked up. You're going to let her live? I know. What's that mean? Like, what do you mean wrong person? Uh, we do have our Ocean Drake for regen right now, so we're sitting pretty. She got her Iceborne, but that won't do much for her versus me, like I've said multiple times, so I don't really know why she rushed it. She probably should have rushed... Maybe a Banshee's Hex Shrinker if she wanted to go super hard, but, uh. My ult's up in 30 seconds. We are gonna rush the Zhonya's next, just because it's such a great item on cannon. You Proto Belt, ult, Zhonya's, and just do a crap ton of damage. Looks like Lucian's Roman top. And I missed that. I'm kind of confused as to why he's here. I mean, he could be getting his tower. Great moral support, guys! We're <laughs> gonna take the tower back and get our components for our uh, 
Zanyas. I actually want to clear this wave first. I'm going to lightning rush through it to get my Mark of the Storm off, if I can get through those. W for the damage. Auto, 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 and back. Red buff has just come up, but I don't want to take that. Lee or Graves. I mean, uh, Lucian would do better with it anyway. So, pick up this, pick up that, and we are on our way to Zonia's. We're what, f uh, 10... What the hell? Oh shit, when did they change that recipe? Yeah, we're uh, 300 gold off buying our Zonia's. We're, uh, um, I kind of want to teleport bot just to get that tower. Lightning Rush, W for the damage. Q, auto, auto, damn. So, we're going to pick up a tower and bot for free, I guess. I mean, I guess Maldahar did die, but so did Poppy. Eh. What, marked for what, six seconds, right? Missed all those but one. Good job, me. We can go back and buy our Zonians right now. Because we have enough gold for it. But if we wait for uh, about 700 more gold, which we can, we'll be able to pick up our boots as well. So we're just going to go ahead and wait for that. Our team's doing very well. So, uh, yeah. We'll see how this goes. La -ta -ta. Oh, sad. So we need 50 gold, so we're going to go ahead and pick up the Scuttle Crab. Let's drop a ward right here, just so we can see if they come. Stun that up. W. Oh, Protobelt. Because why not? It'll be up by the time we get out of base. It's not even 17, or starting 20 minutes. So we walk pretty slow. And honestly, I didn't mean to ult. I meant to just protobolt. So, uh, yeah. I had to make an excuse. <laughs> We're just gonna go ahead top lane. Uh, looks like they're grouping up mid. Poppy's actually very leveled up. Holy shit, I'm level 13, and their support is level 7. The highest person on my team is 13, 11, so I'm like two levels ahead of everyone. That's a dead Poppy. Picking it up with the uh, Ardent Blaze. That's nice. That's nice. I'm going to just go ahead and protobelt. And use my Lightning Rush and my Electrical Surge. My friend and I really like playing Kennen uh, Callista bot lane. Because every time uh, Callista ults, you can just type in chat, uh, Pikachu, I choose you. And throw Kennen at the enemy and then have him... Electrical Surge, Lightning Rush, Thundering Shuriken, and Slicing Maelstrom their entire faces in. And it just it just brings you back to your Pokemon days as a child. Or if you're still like me and are a man-child, just, just like usual days. Um, they're not doing anything about me. I have a ridiculous amount of CS right now, actually. 153 at 19 minutes is actually pretty good. It's not perfect by any chance. Just going to walk up here. Q her. W her. Not taking too much damage. Protobelt is up. Ult is not, but... Oh, come on. Jesus Christ! I just fucked that up so hard, but hey, I got the cannon. What the fuck? Okay, come this way. Oh, you... Okay, fine. Fine. You're gonna die. It's fair enough. No problem. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna go for Rabadons. Or actually, we can go for a Rylai's next. That sounds really fun. GG. Just gonna go ahead and say yes to the surrender. 
And... Oh, they just surrendered too fast. Darn. Well. That was playing Kennen, Protobelt Rush, in the top lane. And, damn, son. I got an S. Hey, level 2. That's fun. Went 5, 2, and 0. Oh, 8.6k. Second highest in the game. Even though a lot of people had more kills than me, but I was I was farming up a storm. Ah! Ah! Farming a, a storm. Cannon. Lightning. Kill me. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all very much for watching. Again, if you have any requests for me to do, just put it down in the comments. I'll add it to my list. And I hope you all enjoyed, and have a wonderful day.